Okay, it's a little ways into the Canon M6 Mark II. We're hitched up to a Rode Wireless Go with a lav mic. We're recording the sound on the Canon M6. I have also in front of me the new Pocket 2. And I'm recording and I'm using DJI's wireless microphone, competitor of the Wireless Go, plugged in with a lav mic. The lav mic is a different lav mic, a uh, Amazon special that I got that was rated pretty high. I have both settings close on the two cameras. I have no idea how this is going to turn out. I didn't adjust or go crazy adjusting the volume of the Pocket 2. And I'm just recording normally with my M6 Mark II. So I hate to do this, but I got to take out the cards and look at what is happening. So let me do that. Wow, I just looked at the footage. Now, you can't compare the Canon M6 Mark II with a 22 millimeter lens that's 2.0 compared to the DJI Pocket Camera. It, they both were done in 1080p with similar settings. The one thing, the Pocket Camera, I had to, in editing, boost the sharpness. I boosted the sharpness to 1 to 1 1.3 in the two sections that you got to see. So I boosted the sharpness to get a little bit better. It was The picture seems a little soft. I still have to play with that. I'm going to try 4K uh, to see if that makes a difference. But this test was really about the DJI wireless adapter to do with a lav mic up against the Rode Wireless Go that's known for its quality. And I will tell you, they're equal. I matched up the soundtracks. You couldn't even tell the difference between the two. Now, I said in the video that I did not check the levels in the DJI microphone setting, and I didn't. I did boost the level a little bit to match the wireless go, but that's because I'm used to having that set up with the Canon M6 Mark II. So hopefully what you got out of this video is one, if you get a defective unit like I got, send it back to DJI. I got this unit and it didn't work. It totally just didn't work. It would sync, but no sound would come out. I sent it back to DJI, went through their process, they only had it three days, sent it back, and probably another 10 days we're looking at, I got this unit, a brand new unit. Um, plugged it in, synced it up, works great. Now that I have that and I did this quick test, I have no doubt I will be using this wireless with the DJI uh, shooting video because it's portable and easy to use. It's not of the same quality as the Canon M6 Mark II. You're just not gonna get the image quality that I get from that with that little sensor that's in DJI, but you get a good picture quality. So for a simple test, for an audio test, DJI has matched the quality of the Rode Wireless Go in their own unit. Now you can't use this with anything else, but if you get the Pocket 2, get the combo kit. Hey, if you like this video, like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all of those things, I really appreciate it if you would like to see more of these kind of videos. Again, 
Thanks for watching.